I'm here to check out a joint where this guy is taking street food to an artisan level. This is Oko. Putin hitting the past. When I tried the food the first time, I was hooked. So I've got the cauliflower wings. There's a lot of East Coast flavors from them in the East Coast of Canada. That's because Chef Mark Steele is from Newfoundland. He went from corporate cooking to catering to this joint. What does Oso mean? Orleans Catering Companies. Orleans is an area here. It's the East End, Ottawa. We take very approachable food everybody likes, but we make things from scratch using local ingredients. You get the burgers and the fries, but then you get the specialty things like the East Coast Donair. Which is a familiar regional dish. It's ground beef that's piled together on a pita bread. Fired up with Mark's own culinary punch. The combination of the sweet sauce and the hot peppers is so, so good. All right, so what are we getting into? An East Coast Donair. A where, with what? It's a spin on a gyro made with ground beef. Now, this is our version. A little more pizzazz, more razzmatazz. Razzmatazz and pizzazz, what so did I get into? We have some ground chuck, about 70-30. Garlic powder, onion powder, smoked paprika, pepper, salt. This is the pizzazz here. Cayenne. This is pizzazz. Then to the meat, fresh oregano. Throw this right on the sheet pan here. Just roll that out, throw it in the oven. 350 for about seven minutes. Now, the donair is something that you find throughout Canada. Especially the East Coast. But this sauce is... Yep what differentiates it from any other beef meat sandwich type you slice thing. Absolutely. We start off with evaporated milk, sweetened condensed milk. Those cows are rich and thick here. Fresh garlic. Because that's what I always do. Evaporated milk, sweetened condensed milk, yeah. garlic. <laughs> Some sugar. I'm just going to add in the vinegar, and you're going to see this thicken. Vinegar is going to tighten this up? Big time. This is where the magic happens. It's already starting to thicken up. I've never seen this. What do you think has happened here? Beautiful. Can we call Alton Brown right now? This is an Alton <laughs> Brown question 101. We've got the meat cooked off. Take it to the flat top. Grill the pita. Hit this right with some down. garlic butter. Dude, this looks awesome. Nice and thin and easy going. A little cheddar, crisp lettuce, a ton of sauce, and then some cherry tomatoes, sweet mini peppers, and sliced jalapeno, some more cheese. Finish it with our pickled red onion. There you go. Look at that. Yeah, huh? Don't you know? Oh, you got a little. That's the way it should be, though. Oh, you bring a bath towel or have a car wash when people leave. They exactly. can just walk through it. Get hosed down. <laughs> Delicious, chef. The meat is what's the most impressive with the seasoning, with the crust, with the caramelization. But when you get the fresh vegetables mixed with the cheese, and then you get the little kiss of the sauce, it rounds it out. That is really good. Don't err in the past. Best don't I've ever had. Seriously. The meat is nice and juicy. It's perfect. Where's my sweet sauce? No, you can't have any more sweet sauce. This is bang on exactly what I've had down east. 